foot jump shot. Going, yes. There are two schools of thought regarding over and help out and change that shot as Shaq will have to become more aggressive in his team defense efforts. Horace Grant in this first quarter. Ewing getting the room. And the rebound handled by Royal. Pops it down for O'Neal. Important ones the other night as he made a drive in the closing seconds against Seattle and that chance to tie the game from the line. Back out to an open man as both teams have really look very stagnant offensively. And it's just a can do make one of the most up normally draws the double team and it does from Charles Smith as they have to double team him but Hardaway Grant shooting Ewing stepping back to feel for O'Neal then throw it out right into the hands of Hardaway Anderson on the drive team today as they are clicking in every area So Anderson able to finish it off. Over to here, but it's going to be a clear out for Hardaway. And watch how Charles Smith has to come over and help out as Hardaway makes the move in the lane and leaves Horace Grant wide open for the shot. This is the unselfishness of Anthony Hardaway. It carries through to the rest of the ball club. By Shaquille O'Neal, but stepping out on the perimeter, he has that in his arsenal and does it very well. Now Ewing stepped out of the double team, so Smith... This one to the repertoire. You're not going to see this too often as Shaquille O'Neal being grabbed and tugged on, able to double clutch a little bit, shoot it on the way. Back in November and then December 2nd here in Orlando, the Magic in a blowout by 25 points. Hardaway, yes, by Smith. I think Penny feels that the Knicks are hanging around, trailing by eight. This time he turns away from the double team. Smith missed the tip. Here comes Hardaway. And a nice little touch off the jumper, and as I just said a little while ago, Hardaway wants to get involved, and he is. Scott, back on the floor. Ball with Tree Rollins. Games against the Knicks, he has averaged 30 points a ball game. Anthony Bonner in the game now, and he's going to stay up pretty tight on Dennis Scott, much as he did last week against Dan Marley. Now that is an offensive foul. Well, Derek Harper got the best of it in the first half against Anthony Hardaway, at least statistically. Here he gets magic from running in this game. Their transition defense has been excellent, as it be has been over the last 20 ball games. Here's Dennis Scott. Yes. Way about three feet, but you're right, Mark, outside his range. But that was the shot that they could, the only one they could get in that particular situation. The Knicks have missed their last six shots. Hardaway with a nice post up. The other night at the end of the game against Seattle, they missed the second on purpose and missed everything. Hit out and try and block that shot, and that enabled Horace Grant to give the Magic. To have two timeouts left. The Magic with three remaining. It is a three marks looking for the shot. Ewing will take the three. Air ball. Handled by Shaw, and that will do it.